When we began talking about this book, our minds were drawn to uh, the text that says to love the Lord your God with all your heart, soul, mind, and strength, and to love your neighbor as yourself. And we really see in the first part, loving the Lord your God with heart, soul, mind, and strength as uh, an indication that we're to love God fully, wholly, right, with all of our being. And so by implication, we're supposed to love our neighbors, heart, soul, mind, and strength, and wholly and fully, because we know, right, that women, we as women are not just a soul or not just a body. We don't just have emotional needs or cognitive needs, right? We, we are whole beings that are complex and multifaceted, and how do we help women in each of those areas of life? The great thing about it is we take those four areas and we divide up the book according to those four areas. And so we have not just me and you writing, yeah. but several of our friends in ministry, women who have such great insights into what it means to love God in those ways. And so I think it's, it's just a great book that's going to help give a paradigm for discipling other women, as well as maybe speaking to a woman in her personal walk with the Lord and how she can love Him in those four ways. 